below the Friday Night Rewards screen below the, the channel. Welcome back everybody. We're here with the funny glasses on and a lovely pint of Guinness. Ah, fuck me. Absolutely superb. Picked up a few wins as well, so always good. Rolling on to the weekend, feeling a bit better. Celtic going to smash it tomorrow. Let's get in amongst it. So anyway, without further ado, we'll uh, open up the rewards. Nothing humongous, but nice to be taking over. Never complain about winning stuff, guys. Never. Um, so, so coins. I've been quite aggressive with the so coins. People out there buying hats, trying to get jerseys and all that sort of stuff. I'm just levelling people up. So, there we go. Leveled up Phil Fodden for this weekend and Sibozlai. Easy for me to say it after starting up the Guinness. So, we hit the threshold cap to 40 Limited. Picked up some additional Ethereum in the Academy as well. Otherwise known as the Bella Ma Benevolent Fund. <laughs> He just done a mental week, didn't he? Just won everything. But um aye, that that that's that's what happens when you've got a gallery of that nature and you're a mad, mad, mad man. Anyway, we can all be mad. Always nice to pick up the Ethereum. Um, I think there's reasons why it needs to be done in the old academy as well. So tonight we'll make sure we open all the rewards as well. Hard to see the colours with these daft specs on, by the way. <laughs> I know it's worth in soon, but anyway. Hopefully people are laughing with me and not laughing at me, if you know what I mean. Um, Christian Paredes, nice, tier 5. Um, never really expecting anything too humongous. Cap 240 limited, tier 4 limited as well. See, we a lot of tier 4s this week. Um, as I said, better than nothing. Nice new card as well. Oh, look at this 3D stuff. Ooh, ooh. They're actually growing on me, to be honest. Like, yeah, I think they are definitely growing on me. I don't mind them. When you see them beside the older cards now, I think they're, I'm coming round to them. So, so, there we go. Tier 3. Kieran Rodriguez. Another nice new card as well. Although the majority of them should be really now, given we've got more of them. We've got La Liga out as well. Good to see. Maybe get some Celtic ones soon. BTS, Melly Mullenstein, good stuff. Maybe we're playing a bit of midfield and things. So, uh, class of defender card, but it's going pretty well. Uh, we picked up a All Star tier three, tier three rare, kind of even the top right, and tier four super rare. Open the super rare first. Uh, it's because it's a lower tier. We swig again. Spanish midfielder, Oscar Rodriguez, good stuff, not really been doing that much but um, was always highly rated when he was younger so that's that's actually could be a pretty nice one, um, yeah he's a good player, um, likes a free kick and stuff as well so that could be quite handy for the Caps so yeah they're pretty happy with that to be honest for that tier, oh pressing the wrong buttons again, that's again a settling in, not even finished like half a one and tier 3 there. The All Star Rare, Mo Salah running down the wing, come on at the end. German Defender from Cole, Timo Hubers. Good stuff. Fantastic. Timo actually scores pretty well, I think. So, um, so that's a good one. That's right. Take the funny specs off now. Starting to hurt my eyes. Feel like I'm in the cinema in the 90s or something there. So, so there we go. So, yeah, that's a nice wee haul again. Taking over. Um, doing well. This one was, you know, Rodrigo Ray with a lack of clean sheet again. That uh, Hoffman came on and scored. Um, this one where we won Oscar Rodriguez. Cavetti never even started after Willis Zimmerman and Mukhtar finally remembered that they're football players. So that's always good. Um, in terms of how we're going on the leaks, um, doing pretty well in the All Star month long. Um, so the all star rare, and you set a leaderboard for this. Obviously, it's pretty hot, but you know, top ten is three hundred dollars and a tier one rare, but still in with a, a wee bit of a chance of getting up in this position. So 
you know, I really like what they've done with the leaderboards. I really enjoyed it. I think it's a good addition. Um, you know, it's not for everybody, you know, that sort of stuff. And I know some people maybe feel as if the guys are really smashing it, you know, they get more rewards and everything, but it gives you a bit of engagement um, over multiple game weeks, which is, is good as well. In terms of what's been happening with the old gallery, um, so I sold David Hanko, um, just couldn't be bothered keeping him after Feyenoord beat um, Celtic. That wasn't the real reason, but um, there we go. So I think I mentioned before, Mike Tweers, Tweezen, Mike Tweezen, I can't even say that. Um, Tygo Land is a guy um, I had on my watch list um, waiting for a card and just decided to kind of go back bonkers and buy the, the first one, but he's pretty highly rated, so it's going to be more of a one to sit on. Um, Talby's the same, although it didn't cost as much, but it's not the one out of card. I love those rookie cards. They look absolutely brilliant. Carol Starfield, big shagger, comes in for a bit of collection bonus action whilst he's not um, away with his female friend that left Celtic. Uh, Nachi Univar, um, that's where the Hanko monies went. So, so yeah, um, really good young player. Um, in and out of the 20 team just now, I think he's injured. So, uh, bottom 16 hours going, I think he got injured 15 hours and 55 minutes ago. But anyway, um, highly rated at Ajax and, you know, one to really look out for and get a low average and everything just now, but maybe a good time to buy him. And then all these guys that are won as well, which is pretty nice. So, so there we go. Um, and that's us. So, it's Friday night. I'm away to have a few Guinness. Chill out. Enjoy some football for the weekend. Might take Glasgow Celtic tomorrow, playing against Livingston. We'll see. We'll be sweating to play sharper line up and everything there as well. Remember, there's two giveaways running. Uh, first giveaway is the October giveaway. I'm going to put the, the link to that video on this one so that you can have a go at that um, if you want to try and win a chance to play in the All Star next month. Also, So Rare Sevens um, is in Scotland next year. Look like a brilliant event. The first one, I bought six tickets for that. There is a Twitter post where I've shared that and basically next Friday we're going to draw five winners and they can come to the event. So there we go, five tickets given away, which is worth um, about £100, so showing a bit of support to the event. So anyway, it's time to go on with the weekend. Good luck, everyone. We end in the customary fashion and go fuck.